Hello and welcome to my corner of the internet. My name is Katie and this is my YouTube channel, Something by Katie. And today I'm here with some first impressions of a new makeup product and it has been a hot minute, a hot hot minute since I have tried any new makeup products. It's extra exciting because it's a new shade of the Smoke Reflect from Auric Cosmetics. This is Sam Ravendahl's cosmetics line. It's a luxury makeup brand. She is a YouTuber, Canadian-based YouTuber, and she has a couple of products in her line um, including other smoke reflect shades and oh shit very droppable <laughs> eyeshadow duos the smoke reflect I have one other shade in the permanent line and this is the holiday 2021 one of the shades I have that on my eyes right now and then of course the glowy luminizer the glow lust I have the shade morganite on my face now and I think I've used this product almost every day since I bought it. I love it so much. But today I'm going to be focusing on the Smoke Reflect and the Holiday 2021 collection. So don't get, forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy watching it. Leave a comment down below. Did you get a product from this holiday launch? Um, what do you think about Oryx line? Have you tried these products? Let me know your thoughts down below. And if you want to see what I thought of this new product, just keep watching. All right, so I am here to be an arbiter of the truth, to fact check claims, and to share my opinion on what I think of these products. So um, Samantha, in her video, she said that she thinks she likes this new holiday packaging better than her standard packaging. And I just have to say, I disagree. I love the black packaging so much more. I think the white looks a little like plasticky. I mean, it is plastic, but you know what I mean? Like it just looks a little cheaper. I love how this looks. Um, so that's my opinion on this packaging. It's fine, but I like the black better personally. When you open it up, you have this lovely white light shifty green color. Did I even mention that I got the shade Entice, which is the beautiful olive green. It's all over my eyes and it's so beautiful. Um, one thing I did appreciate that Sam mentioned, they've changed since the new, um, um, since the holiday collection is they added a pull tab here right here they added a pull tab and that does make a difference this is such a beautiful shade I was so excited when I saw that one of the shades in the holiday collection for Auric was olive there's a cranberry shade as well I went straight for this olive and I love it. I'm going to insert a couple of clips to compare the shade that I have of the other smoke reflect with it, which is Ego. And this is the silver pewter color. You'll notice there's no tab here on this one. So it is harder to get out. This video, I'm just sharing my first impressions of the product and this look that I did today. And I'm going to create a second video with, in which I do multiple looks and experiment with these products a bit because I'm excited to use these colors together. I think that that will be really fun. I think her whole range is starting to build off of itself really, really nicely. And I love, personally, when brands um, for their holiday collections, they do shade extensions or limited edition packaging of existing products. And I think the Smoke Reflect Shadows is a bomb formula. The cream base is great. It sets down. It doesn't budge. I use it in a very multi-purpose way. It can be a good base. I can use it as an eyeliner. Um, you can use it as an all-over smoky shadow. And then the powder shadow is a nice glitter topper or on the inner corner and it adds depth and dimension. I think these are great products. They're on the pricier end. 
Um, so you have to weigh the options. Does it add something to your collection? Um, are you gonna really use the shades to make it worth your while? I have so far. I've really enjoyed my Auric um, <clears throat> Ego Smoke Reflect. As you can see, I've, I mean, I've dipped into this quite a bit. I wore these, um, I wore this to my bridal shower, I think. Uh, yeah, I wore this to my bridal shower. So I really enjoy it. Um, and so far I've really enjoyed this green as well. And I will roll the clips so you can see the look, the process of the look that I've created. But overall, two thumbs up for me. I do prefer the black packaging, but that's kind of nitpicky. kind of surprised the first time I layered this over because it is such a sheer powdery glitter but wow it has some dimension to it do you see the I know I was um going out of focus there on purpose so you can see some of the dimension but then it like it's a really interesting shade in my opinion I think it's nice and it looks gold or light green here, but when you layer it over, it adds that olive pop to the cream base. So I was surprised by how light this shade was, but once I actually got it in my hands and started playing with it, I do like it. It's definitely a drier formula um, <clears throat> than the Ego one. This one's more creamy um, and pigmented. This is definitely sheer, and this one's very pigmented, but I like it so far. This is just a first impression though, because I just got it in the mail. Well, actually, I think it came in the mail Friday, but I just got home from Thanksgiving weekend, the Thanksgiving weekend trip yesterday. So I just got it and tried it today. I think it's really pretty and I'm so excited that Sam is extending this line um, because she had like a gold shade, a champagne shade, a rose gold shade, this um, cool tone gray shade um, and now she has a cranberry tone and this olive tone which chef's kiss magnifi. You did it Sam and it's great and she keeps adding shades to this line as well so as always, I look forward to what Oric does next. I'm really enjoying their line so far, the whole brand and the experience of it. I love the packaging, and I like that she's adding variety. 
um, to her existing packaging for a holiday and it's beautiful so congratulations Sam I'm really loving the product so far don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching it hit subscribe because I am going to do another video using the Auric products to do multiple looks with this entice smoke reflect and I want to incorporate some other eyeshadow palettes like I'm very inspired to use the melt Mary Jane palette with this Entice Smoke Reflect and I want to combine this Ego Smoke Reflect as well and experiment a little so stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next one. Bye!